Freddie Bartholomew was born in London and started his career as a child actor. His early life was marked by significant changes, including being sent to live with his aunt, who became his legal guardian and managed his career. This early shift to the United States played a crucial role in his exposure to acting. He was discovered by George Cukor, who cast him in David Copperfield. This role and the guidance from Cukor set the stage for his future success. His natural talent and the nurturing environment of the Hollywood studio system allowed him to grow into a skilled producer. Key figures in his life, like his aunt and influential directors, shaped his understanding of the film industry and his craft. Freddie Bartholomew was a film producer who left a lasting mark on the movie industry. His work showed his deep understanding of storytelling and his ability to bring out the best in the actors he worked with. Now we're curious to hear from you. What qualities of Freddie Bartholomew do you think make him a lasting figure in film history? Is there a particular movie or moment from his career that you hold dear? We'd love for you to share your favorite memories or experiences related to Freddie Bartholomew in the comments. Your stories are valuable to us. And stay tuned because we have many interesting facts about him to share, including some that are funny, some that are surprising, and some that are touching. Your insights and memories help keep his legacy alive. Freddie Bartholomew, the producer, found his passion for filmmaking as a young boy when he first held a camera at a family event. The joy of capturing moments and creating stories from those images sparked his interest. He would spend hours filming his toys and creating narratives, showing them to his friends and family. This early love for storytelling through the lens grew as he did, leading him to pursue a career in film production. His dedication to bringing stories to life was clear even then, as he would often be found discussing ideas and techniques with anyone willing to listen. This drive and enthusiasm laid the foundation for his future success in the industry. Freddie Bartholomew was a child actor and producer known for his roles in classic films during the 1930s. His most notable works include David Copperfield from 1935, where he played the title character, and Captain's Courageous from 1937, portraying Harvey Chain. These films are considered must-watch for fans and those new to his work. Little Lord Fauntleroy from 1936 is another key film where he starred as Cedric Errol. These movies showcase his talent and are a good starting point for anyone interested in his filmography. Bartholomew's performances were well received and remain memorable parts of early cinema history. Freddie Bartholomew, an early film producer, faced significant financial challenges and doubt from the film industry. Despite limited funds and a lack of support, he showed great determination. He found innovative ways to fund his projects, like securing investments from outside the traditional movie industry circles. His ability to adapt and find unique solutions allowed him to produce successful films and earn respect in the industry. The story is one of true grit and clever problem solving, inspiring many in the film community. In the film Captain's Courageous, Freddie Bartholomew took on the role of Harvey, a character who was originally 15 in the book, but was portrayed as 10 years old to fit Freddie's age. This movie stands out in his career because it's the only time he played a character who wasn't completely good. Interestingly, this character was referenced in J.D. Salinger's famous novel The Catcher in the Rye. The main character in that book, Holden Caulfield, is described as having a similar appearance to Freddy, minus the curly hair, sporting instead of buzz cut. Freddy Bartholomew's career saw a significant turn when he produced the documentary Street Voices. This work received high praise for its honest portrayal of urban life. Critics noted its raw storytelling and strong message. His peers admired the way he captured real emotions, and collaborators appreciated his ability to bring out the best in his team. This project won several awards and set a new standard for documentaries. It also opened doors for Freddie to work on larger, more challenging projects. His work on Street Voices is still talked about today for its powerful storytelling and its influence on new filmmakers. Freddie Bartholomew showed his commitment to his role as Harvey and Captain's Courageous by avoiding a fight with a fellow actor to prevent any facial injuries that could affect his performance. His dedication was evident as he waited until after filming his last scene to address the disagreement, confirming Spencer Tracy's account of the event. In Anna Karenina, Bartholomew's character Sergei connects with the audience in a unique trailer where he directly shares insights about the film. 
Off screen, Bartholomew's life included family moments like the birth of his daughter Kathleen Millicent Bartholomew with Eileen Paul in March 1956, adding a personal chapter to his story. Freddie Bartholomew, as a producer, is known for his unique approach to filmmaking. He often draws from his own life experiences to tell stories that are close to his heart. His work is characterized by a strong personal touch, where he brings his own perspective and insights into the narratives he creates. This personal connection to his work allows for a genuine and heartfelt storytelling style that audiences can relate to. He is attentive to detail and dedicated to crafting stories that not only entertain, but also speak to the human experience. His productions often explore themes of family, relationships, and personal growth, reflecting his own journey and understanding of the world. Bartholomew's work stands out because he focuses on creating meaningful content that resonates with viewers on a deeper level. Freddie Bartholomew, an actor known for his childhood roles, honed his craft at the Italia County School in London, a place dedicated to teaching the art of performance. His personal life saw joy with the birth of his son, Frederick R. Bartholomew, in 1958, shared with Aileen Paul. However, his later years were marked by health struggles, leading him to retire in the 1980s due to emphysema, a lung condition that made it difficult for him to breathe and continue his work. Freddie Bartholomew was a key figure in film production, known for his skill in storytelling and his ability to bring out strong performances from actors. His work helped shape the way stories are told in movies, focusing on clear, strong narratives and character development. He was respected for his dedication to the craft of filmmaking, and his influence is seen in the works of many who followed. Industry experts often speak of his attention to detail and his commitment to quality. Those he mentored or worked with recall his guidance and the standards he set, which many strive to meet in their own work. His approach to filmmaking has left a lasting mark on the industry, encouraging others to focus on the heart of the story and the art of visual storytelling. Freddie Bartholomew's commitment to his role in Captain's Courageous was clear from the start. His co-star, Spencer Tracy, admired Freddie's dedication, especially when he jumped into the water to look authentically wet for the scene, despite already being soaked with a hose and a bucket of water. Tracy recognized the young actor's resilience and talent, saying the kid can take it. Tracy also credited Freddie's convincing performance as a key reason for the film's success. He believed that Freddie's ability to fully embrace his character made Tracy's own portrayal more believable. The authenticity and simplicity of Freddie's acting were praised by Tracy, who felt that its true value would be recognized in retrospect. Contrary to some claims, Freddie Bartholomew was not of Irish descent. His father's family originated from Wiltshire, and his mother's family was from London. Despite an incorrect obituary claiming he was born in Dublin, Freddie's roots were firmly in England. His genuine portrayal of characters on screen was matched by his authentic English heritage off screen. Freddie Bartholomew, known for his work in film production, also leads a life rich with personal interests and values that shape his professional endeavors. He is deeply committed to education and often supports schools and learning programs, believing that knowledge can change lives. His love for nature drives him to be an advocate for environmental causes, supporting efforts to protect natural habitats and wildlife. Freddie's passion for storytelling extends beyond the screen. He is an avid reader and encourages literacy. His belief in giving back to the community is evident in his support for local charities and events that aim to improve the well-being of those around him. These personal pursuits not only reflect Freddie's character, but also influence the stories he chooses to bring to life through his films, often highlighting themes of personal growth, community, and the importance of preserving our world for future generations. While working on the movie Anna Karenina, young actor Freddie Bartholomew experienced a shift in his relationship with co-star Greta Garbo. They got along well at first, but things changed when he asked her to sign an autograph for his uncle. After this, Garbo treated him in a more distant and formal way. Bartholomew was hurt by this change and remembered it for the rest of his life. Additionally, there was a mistake made in a New York Times obituary that wrongly stated his birthplace as Dublin, Ireland, which is not correct according to historical records. Freddie Bartholomew has been a guiding light in the film industry, shaping the way stories are told and movies are made. His work has opened doors for many and set high standards. Looking ahead, he aims to keep inspiring with innovative storytelling and by embracing new technology. 
His advice for newcomers is to stay true to their vision, work hard, and learn from every experience. He encourages them to be open to change and to always look for ways to improve their craft. By doing so, they can find their unique voice and make a meaningful difference in the field. Bartholomew's journey shows that with dedication and passion, one can leave a lasting mark and inspire future generations. Freddie Bartholomew's life story is marked by dramatic turns. As an infant, he was left by his parents and brought up by his aunt, who became a guiding force in his life. His talent as an actor emerged early, and he gained fame as a British-American child star in the 1930s. His most notable role was Harvey in Captain's Courageous, where he shared the screen with Mickey Rooney. Both being of school age, their education was a priority, and time was set aside for their studies during filming. Despite his success, Freddie's early years were shattered by legal battles as his biological parents sought a share of his earnings through numerous lawsuits that lasted over six years. These challenges, however, did not hinder his rise to stardom in the golden age of cinema. Freddie Bartholomew's career in the entertainment industry is a story of dedication and original thinking. Starting out with a clear vision, Freddie worked tirelessly to bring new ideas to life on screen. His journey shows us that with a love for one's craft and a willingness to try new things, lasting change is possible. Freddie's work has not only entertained, but also inspired others to follow their creative dreams. His story encourages us all to keep pushing forward, no matter the challenges, because the drive to create can lead to wonderful places. Freddie Bartholomew faced challenges as he grew up, finding it hard to switch from being a child actor to taking on adult roles. This led him to a career in television where he took on various roles behind the scenes. He became known for his work as a host, director, producer, and even an executive producer. His dedication to the craft was evident early on, especially during the filming of Captain's Courageous. In a scene where his character Harvey falls into the sea, director Victor Fleming and the crew prepared thoroughly to ensure Freddy's safety and to capture the scene in one attempt. The filming was risky with cold water and the need for quick action. Thankfully, with the help of the crew and fellow actor Spencer Tracy, the scene was completed successfully, showcasing Freddie's bravery and the team's commitment to their work. His life and career are documented in the Scribner Encyclopedia of American Lives, which provides a detailed account of his contributions to the entertainment industry. Freddie Bartholomew shared the screen with Mickey Rooney in five notable films. Their collaboration included Little Lord Fauntleroy and The Devil is a Sissy, both released in 1936, Captain's Courageous in 1937, Lord Jeff in 1938, and A Yank at Eton in 1942. Freddie was also in the running for the lead roles in The Prince and The Pauper in 1937. An interesting fact about his life is the discrepancy in his birth date. Officially, he was born on March 28, 1924, but a naturalization document from 1943 lists his birth date as February 8, 1924. This document, despite the error, was signed by Freddie himself and confirmed by two senior officers. Freddie Bartholomew's career was shaped by some of the most respected directors in Hollywood. He worked with Oscar winners George Cukor, Victor Fleming, and Norman Torok, as well as nominees Clarence Brown, W.S. Van Dyke, Henry King, Sam Wood, and Robert Stevenson. His role as Harvey in Captain's Courageous stood out as his personal favorite. The year-long filming process brought the cast close together, forming a bond-like family, which made their farewell at the end of filming an emotional moment for all. Freddie's early life was marked by separation from his parents, who sent him to live with his grandparents and aunt at a young age, severing ties with him from then on. Freddie Bartholomew, once the most loved male child actor of the 1930s, stepped away from the spotlight after his acting career ended in 1951. He kept a low profile, deciding not to dwell on his past fame in public discussions. Despite this, he made an exception and shared his experiences in the documentary MGM when the lion roars shortly before he passed away in 1992. His performances in David Copperfield and Captain's Courageous remain memorable, as both films were contenders for the Best Picture Oscar, showcasing his talent at a young age. Freddie Bartholomew, an actor known for his childhood roles in the 1930s, faced a sad turn of events as an adult lieutenant despite his early success. He struggled financially due to a series of lawsuits concerning his earnings and family disputes over his income. This led to a significant loss of his film fortune, 
which was particularly unfortunate given his earlier fame and the joy he brought to audiences as a child star. His story serves as a reminder of the fleeting nature of success and the importance of careful financial management, especially for those in the public eye from a young age. Freddie Bartholomew's work has touched many and continues to inspire. Share your thoughts on his films and the ways they have moved you in the comments below. If you enjoy celebrating the creative talents and entertainment like this video, share it with friends and subscribe for more. Your support helps us bring more stories and memories to light.